Alan, we're back on. With respect, Councillor, I think our listeners will be more concerned about cuts to public services. It, well, absolutely, Terry, and that's why we've set out proposals Terry, to ensure... let me take it from here, throw me the ball. Councillor, you talk a good game. I caught it, by the way. Um, but I have figures that show that you plan to cut public spending. Are you talking about the raw figures or the figures adjusted for inflation? Yes. Well, the, the first or the second? The, the, the first, the first, the first, the first, right, the first, well, I'd say. Well, in that case, that that's wrong, because if you right. look at the figures, the actual spend has remained the same as last year, see? Yeah. No, I understand it. I'm just, mm. uh, just checking it. Well, it's there. Yeah, that's fine. The, uh, another area where we've seen a, a great deal of public anger is in council housing. Mm. Now, mm. what is the proposal here? I, I mean, meant the second. Sorry, I meant the se I meant the second one. What, when, you, when you gave me the choice before, I meant the I meant the, the second choice choice where the figures are adjusted for inflection. Well, Alan, we've made no secret of the fact that we're not going to keep pace with inflation. In fact, it's inflation. one of the few issues that we have cross-party agreement on, so... Um, right. We've made no secret of the fact that we're bus, going to bus, have bus, to make... Bus fares! I'm sorry? Bus fares. Have you not put up bus fares? As we said in our manifesto, we won't be putting up bus fares in any... Ha have you put up bus fares? Not in real terms. Have you put up bus fares? In line with inflation, we have had to keep pace... Yes or in... no? Have you put up bus fares? In our manifesto... Have you... Stay... Have you... Have you put up bus fares? We've only put up bus fares. Have you put up bus fares? Yes, but only yes, in but as much... Yes, but you, yes, but you, yes, but yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Thank you. If you want to see that interview back online and see me getting a politician to admit something slightly different from what they said earlier and then no, saying, look, you said something slightly different not from actually. what you said earlier. No, and uh, and uh, so, one nil. It's 10am. It's just after 10am. You have been listening to Alan Partridge with special guest Tory Bronwyn, Matthews... Who's Tory, Tory Councillor Bronwyn Matthews. Yeah, her, and what's your name? Terry Cohen. Terry Cohen. Uh, get well soon uh, to uh, Eddie Shadow. Shepherd. Uh, who I'm sure will get well uh, very soon. Uh, that's rhetoric and not a prognosis. Uh, right now, you're listening to Mid Morning Matters with Alan Partridge. See ya. Take a cup of personality, pour in some chat... And drink up some good company. I.e. mid-morning matters with Alan Partridge. Good evening, uh, morning, afternoon. Who cares? Who gives a flying monkey? Because uh, today we're talking about things you don't see much of anymore. Uh, already we have uh, capes, tinned meat, horlicks, sparrows, hula hoops, the crisps, not the toy. Uh, hula hoops, the toy, not the crisp. Uh, swimming pools with deep ends and asbestos. Um, uh, we'll be asking, should we bring some and or all of them back? So do please text, uh, Twitter, spam, fax, page, write and or email 